Hello all dinosaurs and damn safarians Today I'm gonna show you guys fun animals that you can find in the zoo Okay, so basically, I mean at least these animals are available in my local zoo here in Singapore Alright, first figure right here is actually a giant panda So yes, I have seen two pandas in my local zoo and recently they actually gave birth to a baby panda And do you guys know that you know, pandas, they actually have like five fingers and a thumb. So in total, there are like six digits on each of their um, legs. All right, next up, here is a white tiger. White tiger, I mean, if you do a comparison with the orange tiger, the eyes, the color of the eyes and the nose are actually different. So the white tiger has like blue eyes and a pink nose. All right. And um, yes, orange tiger, I mean, they could be like Bengal tiger or Siberian tigers. Next up, the fastest land animal. I've actually seen them in cages in um, the zoo in um, Singapore. And they're really beautiful big cats. Not exactly very big, they're actually quite small as compared to a tiger. They're actually super fast. They can run up to like 120 kilometers per hour. So that's pretty impressive. Hippopotamus, I've definitely seen plenty of them in my local zoo. Yep, they're huge and they're pretty aggressive animals. Black bear, I know that you can definitely find the black bear in uh, many zoos in the world, but I've never seen one in uh, the zoo in my country. But I've definitely seen jaguar. Yes, jaguar, I've seen plenty of them in my local zoo. Alright, love the spots on this beautiful big cat what else we've got um polar bear i've definitely seen um, the polar bear in the zoo but the polar bear in my local zoo has actually passed on like last year so it's very sad we can no longer see like polar bears in the zoo anymore it was with um us for like over 20 years so it's like 28 years yeah so yeah it was a pretty good i mean i think the polar bear was being treated very well by the zookeepers. Um, yes, fish such as um, the large mouth bears can also be found in many zoos, including the one in my local country. Orangutan, we actually have plenty of orangutans in, uh, in, the, in the zoo. They're extremely docile and um, very intelligent animals. Elephants, yes, I've definitely seen elephants everywhere, um, you know, especially in my local zoo. And also in countries such as Thailand, where they really, really um, focus a lot of a lot on you know elephants, elephant shows. Not a huge supporter of all these shows because you know the elephants you know may be tortured to like perform tricks to show you guys. Yeah, another creature that we can usually find in the zoo is actually this um, rhinoceros. All right, plenty of them. In fact. Crocodile, yes, I've seen them as well, but this one is actually a Nile crocodile, which is a, a crocodile from the Nile River. So I'm not too sure whether the um, crocodiles in here in my zoo are actually the same type or same species. Giraffes, I've actually seen plenty of them. They are actually like um, four to five giraffes in my local zoo, so that's pretty cool. Um, this is a caiman. Yeah, I've actually seen one of them inside this. Um, aquarium, yes, I call it a, a, an aquarium because it is basically an enclosure with like glass and um, it's very small, it's about this size, just slightly bigger than this this box right over here. Another um, orangutan to show you guys, okay, they're extremely, extremely beautiful, I feel. Another rhinoceros, okay. You can also find cassowary, I've actually seen them, cassowary in the zoo. The flightless bird. Kangaroos, we also have a section dedicated to like Australian animals, and our kangaroos are actually one of them. Cheetah, or, or is this a leopard? I think this could be a leopard, but you know, whether it's a leopard or cheetah, you can find both of them in my uh, zoo here in Singapore. Um, this is a horse. We do have a farm animal section in the zoo and you can see like you know plenty of farm animals such as um, horse, pigs and cows, sheep as, sheep as well. Lion, yes we have a section dedicated to African animals and lions is definitely one of them. Crocodile like what, what I've mentioned. 
Um, yes, you can find them, plenty of them. This is actually a black panther. So the black panther and the um, jaguar were actually kept in the same enclosure. Here's the strike. Another kangaroo right here. Zebra, definitely you can find plenty of zebra. In fact, we have a herd of zebras, like you know, a few, a couple of, maybe like 10 zebras in, in the enclosure, I'm not too sure. Another zebra right over here. Cheetah for sure. And um, giraffe, of course giraffe. I've actually seen two giraffes like fighting against each other. They, they call this necking, which means that they basically use their neck and strike against each other. I'm not too sure why they do that. You know, possibly, you know, to challenge each other. I'm not too sure, but it was really loud in the neck, like, you know, just like striking against each other. It's, it was really, really loud. And I was, was pretty scary in, in some ways because you can actually feel the impact. Um, like what I've mentioned just now, um, basically you can find cows in the farm section cows, horses, pigs, plenty of them. This is a lioness, of course, in um, that little enclosure. You can see um, different lions and female lions as well, which is known as a lioness. All right, and um, this is a hippopotamus. Yes, like what I've mentioned, um, yes, you can find plenty of rhinoceros and also hippopotamus. Tiger, all right. Tiger, yes, we have seen like orange and white tigers in the same enclosure, I think. Great white shark. Okay, there's actually an aquarium here, not exactly the zoo. There was an aquarium here in Singapore where you can find different sea animals and great white shark is definitely one of them. But this is actually a megalodon, which you, you are not able to find any of them right now because they are already extinct. This is basically a prehistoric shark. Elephant, yes, we can find elephants in the zoo. They are actually very well trained and you can also sit on them as well um, for like an elephant ride. And um, right here is a koi fish. In fact, you can find plenty of koi fish everywhere here in Singapore. There are plenty of like ponds everywhere and um, koi fish can be found inside these ponds. But recently there has been like a family of otters. They have been going around you know, and trespassing into different places, entering the ponds and eating up all the koi fish. So that is that. That is actually very scary because some of these koi fish are actually very old. Some of them can live up to like 100 years old and to be eaten up by the otters just like that. I mean, the owners will definitely feel very, very sad, right? All right. Okay, um, I'm gonna pick my most favorite zoo animals from this video. I mean, definitely I'm gonna pick a lion because lion is actually one of my most favorite animals. I love the great white shark as well. Um, what else? Maybe I'll just pick two more. I love the elephants. I really love the elephants. And uh, the next one should be a rhinoceros. What about you guys? So my most favorite herbivores is definitely the rhinoceros and the elephant. My most favorite carnivorous um, animals will be um, the great white shark. I mean, I mean, if you just want me to name animals, I'm gonna go with um, lion and um, probably tiger. What about you guys? Let me know down below, okay? Thanks for watching this video and I'll see you guys soon in the next one. Goodbye.